doing a Louis Vuitton collection video. Um, my collection is not very big, but I definitely hope to in the future expand it a little bit more. Um, I'm going to start out with my accessories first, just like the smaller Louis Vuitton items that I own. And I've actually made um, quite a few videos on several of these bags and items, so I will leave those videos down below of the um, Louis Vuitton items that I have that I've reviewed or made a video on um, and talked about. So if you're interested, those will be down below. All right, so first I have my pochettes. I have the old pochette and the new pochette. Um, old pochette and monogram and new and dummy azor. And I'll just show you them really quickly. I do have this Louis Vuitton strap that I bought separately um, on the pochette. I used to use it like this before I got my favorite PM. So that's a little idea. Um, all right, so that's what they look like. Those are the two that I own. So my pochettes. Um, next, I have my key clay or key pouch, whichever you prefer to call it. Um, love this for every day. I really don't even use a wallet. I just put my cards and cash in here and my keys on here, and I just love this. This is perfect. I feel like this is a must in, in your Louis Vuitton collection. Um, so this is in the Damier Bean. Um, I love this key pouch so much. It comes in handy for every day. I love this. All right. And the only wallet that I actually own from Louis Vuitton is this wallet, and I believe it's discontinued. I'm pretty sure it's not on the website anymore, but I have seen it on Trades, the eBay. I have seen it online. Um, so it's the, I think it's like the compact bifold wallet. So it looks like this, um, and it has the um, zipper where you can put your coins. Um, so yeah, I really like this though because it is compact. Um, I don't use it as much anymore. I definitely use my key pouch a lot, but I used to use this a lot and I like that it is kind of small and compact. So um, really pretty wallet um, and monogram. All right, so I guess I'll start out with this as well. Um, this was my newest bag that I just got a couple weeks ago. This is the favorite PM and Damier Bean and I made a video on this. I'll leave that down below if you're interested um, in a review unboxing kind of video. And I'll show you what it looks like on me put it over and it's just the perfect like crossbody kind of messenger bag um, and I feel like the MM was too large for me but I love the PM I feel like it is definitely the perfect size um, for my frame and, and height and everything so beautiful bag it has the red lining um, and this is the bag that I'm currently using love this for every day it is so perfect definitely check out the favorite um, bags if you're looking for a messenger because they are beautiful um, and you can also use it I showed in the video but you can also use it as a little clutch so I love that very pretty all right so next on to my bigger bags um, let me start out with this isn't a big bag but this is the speedy 25 um, in monogram and I feel like a speedy or a neverfull would be um, definitely like one of the um, top purchases that I like if someone would have told me, I definitely feel like um, a speedy or a neverfull is perfect for like your first Louis Vuitton purchase. Um, so this is what it looks like and I'll show you on the crook of my arm. This is the smallest speedy that they have, but um, I definitely feel like the bandolier or like a separate strap like this one would be so cute as like a little messenger bag because this is just like the perfect um, small kind of bag and I feel like it would be so cute with um, a strap on it as a little messenger. So. That's what it looks like. Um, so this is very cute. I love the Speedies and I love the Neverfulls. Those are definitely my favorite um, Louis Vuitton bags. So I do wanna get um, a bigger Speedy because that's the only Speedy that I own. All right, so next this is the Galliera. I believe that's how you say it. And this bag is discontinued as well. I'm pretty sure, um, but you can definitely still find these bags online and these Louis Vuitton items that are discontinued. So this is what it looks like. I love the feet on it um, and I just love this bag I feel like that it's I just feel it's so classy so it just looks very very um I don't know just classy and just such like a a cool looking bag I love the shape of it so and I love this as well I love the strap on it so and you can adjust it to make it a little bit longer or short shorter so this is in the um monogram print I believe it was the Galliera, and I think that's the PM size. I'm pretty sure that's the PM. I don't think it's, yeah, I think that is the PM. All right, so next is the Odeon MM. I actually wish I had this bag in the PM, but this is discontinued on their website. Um, they still have the PM, though. That one is still um, available on their website, and this is in the monogram print, and I will show you really quickly what this looks like on me. Just because I am 
shorter. I'm 5'4". I feel like it it just looks too too much for me. I feel like too it's a little too long, I feel like. I feel like um, the PM size would be better, just in my opinion, for my um, height. But if you were taller, the MM is definitely um, a great size, and you can find them online. So this is the Odeon and the MM. All right, so next I have my Neverfulls. These are my last bags. Um, this is the PM size of the Neverfull and Damia Bean. It has the red lining with the pochette that it comes with. Um, beautiful bag. This was my first never full and then I got my GM, but I've made a video on this and my GM if you're interested um, And I just love this bag. I feel like when I tried it on this store I was like eh, is it gonna be too little too small of a bag for me? But I feel like since I am 5'4 I'm shorter. It just looked so cute um, Just like a cute petite bag on me. So this is what it looks like and on my shoulder if you were taller i'm not sure if you would like this in my opinion if i was taller i would not like this bag i would definitely go um maybe for like an mm i think that's a great like in the middle kind of bag um so there you go that is the pm all right and this is the gm huge bag favorite bag that i own um i just think this is great i've used it for travel as an everyday bag, I feel like this would be perfect for a work bag, a beach bag. It's just, it's so awesome. I feel like it's versatile. You can use it for a lot of different things. It comes with a pochette, and I'll show you really quickly what it looks like on me. And I have a whole video about this bag. So if you're interested, definitely check it out. That's what it looks like. I just love how big it is. I love how huge it is. It's just the perfect tote. So love this bag so much. I would definitely recommend over any of um, the Neverfulls, the GM size. It's so big, but you can cinch it in and make it a little bit smaller to the size of like an MM bag, um, the MM size. So I love that you can cinch it in. I just love, I love this bag so much. Oh my gosh, I'm like obsessed with this bag. So, and I love it in that print as well on the Azure. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you have any video requests, please leave those down below. Thumbs up this video and subscribe. See you next time.